afternoon baseball here on the show. Ought to be a good one here between the St. Louis Cardinals and the Philadelphia Phillies. Settling in now, Colton Wong. He will lead this one off today. Now here it comes. Oh, that's off the plate. Good time to call the change as he swings and misses for strike two. Tough curveball that time, but he's able to make a little contact to keep this at bat going. Now another 2-2. 65 degrees okay. our temperature here at first pitch. Three and two, full count. Now the payoff pitch home. And he finally wears him down here as he strikes him out after a nine pitch at bat. Here's Dexter Fowler now. His past line against Aaron Nola. He's a 333 hitter. He's also hit a couple of home runs against him. All even now, two and two. And it's fouled away. Another one sent foul. Don't be shocked if this pitcher tries to go a little bit further outside the zone. Three foul balls in a row. He wants to get a swing and a miss on this next pitch. Look out. Don't want to hit him there. It's full three and two. Skied into straightaway right. On the move is Harper. He gets there, and that's the second out. And that brings up Paul Goldschmidt. The first baseman, Paul Goldschmidt. The one two is taken for ball two. And a full count to Paul Goldschmidt. Three balls and two strikes. Got him swinging as he runs the fastball by him to end the inning. Into the box now, Gene Segura. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. Here now the 2-2. Doesn't get the zone. Count full now. Swung on and lifted in the air to left center. On the run is O'Neal. He's there, but oh, he clanks it off his glove. And he is in there. Here's Andrew McCutcheon now. He went deep in the contest last night. Ready with the 3 1. McCutcheon will take one that misses. It's ball four. Next to dig in will be Bryce Harper. He's three for seven in the series coming in. The 2 2. And he fouls this one off. Two and two count. Here it comes. In the dirt, but it's swung on for the third strike. Good job to corral this quickly as the runners hold on. Coming to the plate now, Reese Hoskins. And he could give his guys an early lead if he can come through here. He's set and the 2 1 pitch. Way inside with that one, a pretty easy take there. And he misses with it, ball four, so that'll load the bases, and now he's really going to need to get a ground ball. The third base. So now to the plate, Didi Gregorius. First chance for him here after appearing as a pinch hitter in the game last night. A ball and two strikes now. Looking for the strikeout. Here's the one, two. High 
high in the air out to center field. Catch made in center. Here comes the runner from third. And the run will score as the Phillies are off to a 1 0 lead. Stepping up to the plate, JT Realmuto. And the Phillies trying to make this first inning even better here. The set and the 1 1. Back up the middle and in for a base hit. And the run's going to come in to score from second as they grab a two to nothing lead now. In now, Nick Williams. Boy, not close again. His third walk of the inning as that misses for ball four. And in steps Scott Kingery. And he's got that batting lineup near the 300 mark entering play. And this could be trouble now. It's three and one. Call didn't go his way on two and one, but it's important here on three and one to still make a quality pitch. You have to have the mindset that you're still the one in the driver's seat. O'Neill is there, and he puts it away as they're able to escape with only limited damage on the scoreboard. Here's Matt Carpenter. In eight at-bats in the series, he's collected three hits. Hey, we're still in the early stages in this one. They're only down by a couple of runs. But it's really key for this leadoff guy to try to get on and get a big inning started. And he lays off again, ball three. Paul DeYoung is on deck. Fouled off. Into the windup, ready with the payoff pitch. Weak grounder down the line at third. Got him. So the bases are empty with one man gone. And that'll bring in the Good Illinois football. State product, oh. Paul DeYoung. DeYoung. The 1 1 home is laid off for ball two. I don't blame him for not coming over the heart of the plate. He circled this guy on the lineup card when he got to the yard today. He's been swinging one of the hotter bats in the game. The 3 1. And that's outside. He lost him ball four. Coming to the plate now, Yadier Molina. And he's a guy looking to break out in a big way. Hasn't been getting the results he or his club have been hoping for. The one two. High fly ball out to straightaway center. Williams is under it and he brings it in for the second out of the inning. Now batting Tyler O'Neill who takes his first cuts in this one with a man at first and two away. The 2 1 is swung on and missed for strike number two. Two two pitches fouled away. Working for the punch out and the offering. Good spot for an RBI. Put the ball in play with the runner in motion. He could score all the way from first. He got him. Lively fastball that time, and it puts an end to the inning. Stepping into the box, Aaron Nola. One of the keys to securing a win, they want to keep the pressure on and try to build that lead as much as they can moving into the later innings. One and two now as that one's fouled off. And now pitch on the way. Grounded back up the middle. And that is through into center, a base hit, and the opposing pitcher gets aboard to kick off the inning. The batter, number two, Into the box now, Gene Segura. Now a ball swung on and heading for the stands in right, and that'll move the count to one and two now. Lofted in the air out toward right center. Fowler has a read on it, and that's the first out of the inning. 
Digging in to try it again, Andrew McCutcheon. He reached on a walk in his last time up and later came around to score. The 1-1 one -one now to McCutcheon. Popped him up. Molina over to his left. And he brings it in for the second out of the inning. So a runner at first with two away. And that'll bring in a dangerous hitter indeed in the form of Bryce Harper. Swing and a miss on a pitch outside. One and two now. So far in this game, he's the only guy in the lineup that's gone down on strikes. This is the only guy in the lineup that struck out so far, and now he finds himself in the hole with two strikes. Here now the 2-2. Doesn't hit the target. It's ball three. Well, this has been a good at-bat. He's now worked to count full to three and two. It allows the runner on first to be on the move with two away. Slider whiffed on for strike three. A great pitch to put an end to the inning. Digging in, Lane Thomas. He'll begin things here against Aaron Nola. Here it comes. Pops this one up. Segura onto the grass. And that's the first hit in this one for the Redbirds. The pitcher, number 18. Into the box, Carlos, Carlos Martinez. Martinez. And they indeed have the pitcher bunting here as he gets this one down. Only plays to first, so the pitcher does his job as it's a successful sacrifice. Now that At the plate, the Colton pitcher. Wong. He went Colton. down looking to open up the ball game. And there's ball two now. This one's in the dirt. No advance here, but it's three and one now. Hit on the ground out to short. And that's the second out. Stepping into the box, Dexter Fowler. Now runner in scoring Mike position with Sugan. Dexter. Thomas oh. at second with two down. Pulled toward right center field. Harper giving chase. He's there to track it down, and that'll end the inning. Bottom of the inning now. Digging in, Reese Hoskins. He drew a walk his first time up. A 1 1 home. Hard hit ball to second. And that's through for a hit. Now batting, third baseman, Didi. At the plate now, Didi Gregorius. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. To two and two now. <laughs> It's not easy to get your barrel to a pitch that high. That can be an effective location as long as he keeps it above the letters. Full count, three and two. Open to send him packing. Pitch on its way. Line drive snagged on a short hop. On to first, and they get them both. So base is empty now, now after the double play. The and next to hit is the catcher, JT Real Muto. Now the 2-1. Hit in the air down the right field line. But this will wind up being a foul ball. You're lucky if you get one pitch a night right down the middle. Cannot be late on that fastball. Trying to nibble here and he misses to run it full now. Three and two. And this one misses for ball four. So the Phillies have got themselves a two out base runner. Up next will be Nick Williams. Four hits already in the series through seven at bats. Got him swinging, and that will end the inning.
Here's Paul Goldschmidt now. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. Things not looking very good so far in this one, but we're still in the middle innings. They're down by a couple of runs, and this will be the right place and the right time to get something going. The last thing they want to do is to try to come from behind and win this one in the eighth or ninth inning. 3 1. Hey, throwing the ball great up until this point. Don't want to allow a leadoff walk. Needs to just focus in on his mechanics right here. Oh, and he can't pick it up cleanly. And the recovery is too late as he's able to beat the throw to first. Runner at first following the error. And set to go is the third baseman, Matt Carpenter. The set and the 1-1 pitch. Lifted in the air out towards left center. Williams is under it. He's got it one away. So Paul DeYoung digs in next. Paul DeYoung. Can't keep the weight back, and he falls behind one and two. He's set. Now the pitch. And a fastball swung on and missed as he just reared back there. Two away. The catcher, so it's a runner at first with two Yadier. gone. And here now is the catcher, Yadier Molina. The 1-1. One, one. No runs, just one hit. One error for the Cardinals to this point. Two and two to the Cardinals catcher. So you'd love for him to offer at that one, but the execution was flawless. Nice curveball that starts in the zone and breaks just out. A dive, but it's off his glove. And we'll have to leave it there as the play is made here to end the inning. Ready to go in the bottom of the fourth. Digging in now for Philadelphia, Scott Kingery. He flew out in his last at-bat. Fouled away. Ready now with the payoff pitch. Now a ball lined to the left side. Foul. Oh, and he lets him off the hook there as this isn't even close for ball four. Stepping in and ready for another shot, Aaron Nola. One and one, here it is. Now a throw over to first, and he's back easily. A runner at first with no outs here. Front sign still on on one and two, and he gets this one down. And you can't ask for much more out of a pitcher than that. The sacrifice works to perfection. Gene Segura standing in. He's 0 for 2 in the ballgame so far. The 2 1. Got him swinging in the dirt. Molina has it. And he makes the throw to first. Segura is retired. Two down now. Two are gone in the Philly fourth. And that will bring up the former Andrew. National League MVP, Andrew McCutcheon. The 1-1 pitch. Swing and a ball hit on the ground. Throw on to first, gets him, and the side is retired. At the plate, Tyler O'Neill. He looked to bounce back after striking out his last time up. Sometimes you just got to tip your cap to the guy on the mound. He's getting paid to try and get you out as well. Anytime it gets up there north of seven, eight pitch ABs. Sometimes it just comes down to pure execution. Let's see if he makes the adjustment right here. Slow roller out to short. And the fifth inning will start with a ground out, one away. Ready for another chance? Lane Thomas, one for one after a single this first time up. 
Yeah, guys, still the only hit in this game so far. They've been pretty well shut down. Guys on the mound have really much controlled the whole outcome up until this point. And this is swung on and missed, so it's two up, two down to start the fifth. Tommy Edmond will get the call here as he'll hit for the pitcher. Two out, nobody on. Into center field, line drive, base hit. Now the second baseman, so now to the plate, Colton Wong skied in the air to straightaway left. And McCutcheon will put this one away, and the inning is over. Ladies and gentlemen, your attention. So a new pitcher is set to go now here as the right hander Adam Wainwright gets the call. 50. Adam striding in, Bryce Harper. He's hitless in his two at bats so far. Ball and two strikes. Two strikes. And he can't get out of the way there. So the leadoff man will be aboard to open up the inning. Digging in and looking for more. Reese Hoskins. He steps in off a base hit in his last at bat. Hit hard up the middle. That's through for a base hit. He's now two for two in this one. And now he has some trouble with it in center. To the plate now, Didi Gregorius. And he takes one off the inside corner for ball two. Never tempted to swing at that ball down low. It's ball three. This is a spot you like to be in as a good hitter. Runners in scoring position and count leverage in your favor. Checked his swing there, and did he go? No, he did not, says the third base umpire. So it's ball four. So striding in, JT Realmuto. It was a walk in his last trip. A 1-1. Hit hard on the ground to second. Oh, look at Wong. One there. Oh, but he beats it out. An outstanding effort that time, but that's a base hit, and the run's in to score. Runners on the corners now with one man gone. And digging in at the plate, the Texas native Nick Williams. The 2-1. Everyone in the ballpark knows what the pitcher's intentions are in this situation. Great job at the plate to lay off a tough pitch in a good spot. Boy, look at that thing dart. It's full now, three and two. Line drive to left. Base hit, and that'll get a run in. Now back, second baseman. Standing in now, Scott Kingery. In the dirt here. And a nice job to keep the runners at bay as the count moves to two and two. Has a look, now the pitch. Line to the right side. The tag will get him coming back to first. It's a double play, and the inning is... Standing in, Dexter Fowler. 0 for 2 from him so far in this one. This one doesn't look good so far. Down by a boatload as we enter the middle innings. It's about time they get something going. And the last thing you want to do is fall behind where you have to score a bunch in the 8th and ninth inning. And they'll try to get him fishing there, but he won't offer in the dirt. And it's back to even at 2 and 2. Popped him up. Real Muto has a play. One away. Standing in, Paul Goldschmidt. No hits for him to this point, not unlike many of his fellow teammates. The 1-1. One, one. Takes a pass and misses. That's strike two. No runs, two hits, and two errors to this point for the Cardinals. Line toward right center. And that finds some outfield grass. It's a base hit. The third baseman, number 13, Matt Carpenter. 
At the plate, Matt Carpenter hit on the ground out to short. Segura fields it cleanly. On to first, it's a double play. As their woes continue, the inning is over. Next to hit will be the pitcher, Aaron Nola, getting to hit for himself here, largely due to the big cushion he's got to work with. Now the one and one pitch. Breaking ball misses the corner, two balls and two strikes. Looked like he was a little over aggressive there to throw that nasty curveball. Just needs to slow his delivery down a bit. Now the fastball is right by him as he swings and misses for the first out of the inning. The batter, number two. One out for the Phils in their half of the sixth. And that'll bring in Gene Segura. And oh, a big rip at the curveball, but he didn't get it, and he becomes the second casualty of the inning. So the next hitter to dig in will be Andrew McCutcheon. First two men in the inning have both gone down via the punch out, so we'll see if he can fare any better. Ball taken there, two and one now. Wayne right into the windup. Here it comes. I know to the fans that probably looked like something good to hit. But unless you're sitting breaking ball right there, I don't care if it's middle. And that'll just sneak past his outstretched arm, a base hit. The right fielder, number three. Right. Into the box, Bryce Harper. Harper drilled on the ground to short. And the throw to Wong, and the inning is over. So that brings in the power-hitting middle infielder, Paul DeYoung. It doesn't look very promising so far in this one as we move into the later innings. Down by a bundle, it's time to get some base runners and hopefully a long ball to get them back into this one. A little early, and now it's even at two and two. And it's fouled away. The two two one more time it is taken, yep. ball three. And it's late to his afternoon of work, and the longer this at bat goes, the better chance of him making a mistake. But as a guy starts to tire, they're more likely to leave the ball up. Oh, and it sailed right over his head at first. And now, oh, this ball's going to wind up out of play. And a big mistake there. The one-two. Hit in the air to straightaway center. Williams is under it. Makes the play, one away. And the runner, not tagging, will retreat to second base. Now back. One gone for the Redbirds in the seventh. And into bat next will be Tyler O'Neill. Two balls and a strike. Here it comes. Into center field, and that's going to get down for a base hit. And they'll get back a run here as they're on the board. It's 4-1. The better field of the 35. Lane. At the plate now, Lane Thomas. And he takes ball two, and it's two and one. And it's two balls and two strikes now. Something that stood out to me in this game is the lineup's lack of a solid plan at the plate. Seems like way too many guys are chasing pitches out of the zone and trying to hit pitchers, pitchers like that one down and away. There's no success in that. The 2-2. Two -two. Keep in mind, people, the longer the at-bat, the higher the likelihood that this becomes his last inning. The 3-2 pitch. Hit hard on the ground at first. And a backhanded reach at first, but he can't flag it down. And that runner will go no further than second as there are two aboard now. Sir Anthony Dominguez comes on to pitch here with one man gone in the top of the seventh. Jairo Munoz is out of the dugout now as it looks like he'll come on and hit for the pitcher, Wainwright. Off-speed pitch in the dirt as he takes it for a ball. 
Rounded down the third baseline, but this will wind up a foul ball. Two and two. Working for the punch out and the offering. First and second now, one man out. Hard hit ball to second, and that's through a base hit. O'Neill is on his way home. Safe at the plate as the lead is cut to four to two now. Stepping in now, Colton Wong. A ball and two strikes now. Everything this guy throws is hard. That changeup he throws is in the high 80s to go along with that good heater. Swing and a miss, and they'll dodge a major bullet that time. Two away. Now at the play, Dexter Fowler. And we'll see what he can do here. Two on, two away, two home so far this inning. And that misses two and one. Great chance right here as a hitter to be really aggressive. With two guys already on, pretty good shot. He's going to get a challenge pitch right here. Fastball, and mm, looks like they're pinching him a bit here. It's three and one. Every base runner in a close game like this really matters, so you can't afford to be giving out free passes this late. Open to send him packing. Pitch on its way. Swing and a miss as he chased with two strikes, and that will retire the side. John Brebbia gets the call from the pen to take over on the mound and start the home seventh. Next to bat will be Reese Hoskins. He reached on a single last time and later wound up scoring. The 1-1. Here's a little chopper up the middle. DeYoung fields it cleanly. And the off-balance throw beats him at first, and that's a tough play. Striding into the box, Didi Gregorius. Seventh inning here at the ballpark. 4-2 our score. A ball and two strikes to Didi Gregorius. And he fouls this one off. The one two. Hit hard on the ground towards second. Wong is there. Throw gets him. Two down. Ready now. JT Wilmuto. He singled earlier, making him one for two to this point. Lays off the slider that time. Two and one. Fouled off. Bases are empty here with two men out. This is hit high and deep out to left. Ranging back is O'Neill. On the warning track, he makes the catch. Jose Alvarez has been summoned from the bullpen as he'll do so to start the eighth. Number 52. Into the box, Paul Goldschmidt. He's got a hit in three at bats to this point. Even though we're moving into the back end of this game, they're only down by a couple of runs. You know that old slogan, a bloop and a blast. They can... And now a diving effort, but this is off the center fielder's glove. The third base, number 13. In now, Matt Carpenter. Two balls and a strike to Matt Carpenter. Alvarez is among a dying breed of those lefty specialists whose roles are changing with the new rules around reliever usage. Fouled away. The 2 2. This is skied into the air to straightaway center. Williams is under it. One down. So a runner at first now with one away, and that'll bring in the Illinois State product, Paul DeYoung. Here's the 1-1. One, one. 
tight break with the slider there catches the inside for a strike. And this is sent on the ground out to Segura at short. To second for one. Relay to first in time. And just like that, this side is retired. Your attention, please. New now pitcher to tell you about. It's a guy drafted number six overall out of North Carolina in 2006. The six foot six inch lefty Andrew Miller. Bottom of inning number eight set to go. Now at the plate, Nick Williams. A hit in two at bats for him at this point in the ball game. And this is taken here for ball four. So the leadoff man's on base to kick off the home eight. Getting late, 4-2 our score as we play the eighth inning. Fastball well outside. Sometimes you got to be aggressive offensively, but sometimes you just let the pitcher dig his own grave. Patience and discipline seem to be the way to go right here. Three and one to him now. Hitters count all the way. Here it comes. Lofted in the air out toward right center. Fowler has a read on it. One down. Davey Grion will grab a bat and hit for the pitcher here. Number 73, Davey Grion. Grounded up the first baseline. A dive and oh he can't hang on. And the flip will go to Miller here for the out. Now back to the top of the lineup. The Stepping batter, in, two. Gene Segura. Struggling so far in this one and looking to erase his 0 for 4 ball game right here. Look into Molina. Now the 1-1. One, one. And a fastball that misses up in the zone here. It's 2-1. Hit well on the ground to first. Goldschmidt will take this to the bag himself, and with that, the inning comes to a close. David Robertson comes out of the bullpen to shut things down here in the ninth. Number 30. New inning set to get underway. Into the box now, Yadier Molina. He's hitless in three at bats to this point. Looking for base runners here as they're down two playing on the road. Not an easy thing to do trying to score runs or bunch hits together off of a closer. Now the one two coming to Molina and the knuckle curve freezes him as he becomes out number one. Now batting. Now at the play now Tyler O'Neill singled Tyler. home a run in his last time up. Ready to deliver the one and two. And he strikes him out as well. So make it back to back punch outs here to the first two men he faces out of the bullpen. Two out nobody on. And the sliders in the dirt as he lays off it for a ball. Now that's popped up. Hoskins is there. Makes the catch and that's the ball game. It's always nice to give your fans at home something to cheer about and they definitely did that right here. Coming through with a big win at home. Four to two the final score today. The Phils jumped out to an early lead in the first and never looked back. Aaron Nola wins his third of the season. Carlos Martinez was only able to work four innings as he takes the loss. David Robertson records the save, his seventh of the campaign. So that just about does it for Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, Heidi Watney, and our entire crew. I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, make your way over to theshownation.com. this afternoon. First for the victorious Philadelphia Phillies. Four runs on six hits. Two errors. They left ten men on base. For St. Louis. Two runs. Seven hits. Two errors. They left eight men on base.
time of the ball game two hours and fifty two minutes thank you